So my sister and I do this thing where we don't finish each other's sentences, we steal complete sentences. <laughs> we say the same words and phrases simultaneously and then immediately look at each other and say, let me be my own person. <laughs> and then we laugh. And the funny thing about siblings is that it can feel like being in a relationship with your reflection. Like you are standing next to them simply because they are the other half of this double helix. You are in a home made of genes and good memories built to bear any weight of any bad day. A place where sibling and safe become synonyms. Three months ago, I watched my mother hold hands with a man as he turned into a memory. Mm -hmm. They whispered brother and sister back and forth to each other until his voice gave out, until his breath gave out, until he gave out. And now, I've watched my mother reach for a reflection that's not there. Extend her hand towards a double helix and find nothing holding her in place. A homeless heart. And I find a note in my phone titled, Things I Don't Want to Forget. And the only thing written there is my sister's love for named humor. Like, even years ago, I knew how important it would be to remember every negative Nancy, every starving Marvin, Debbie Downer, every geez Louise. <laughs> like, the biggest loss I could ever have is forgetting her laugh. How I can always find home in our humor. How I can always count on it. How it can change how I see a whole day. My mom, my mom has a hard time looking today in the eyes. Knows that she will be doing it alone now. On her own now. And I feel my heart crawling back home, whispering, let me be my own person. But please, don't leave me alone. 